Today, I'm going to tell you the best and worst skin for every single brawler in the game. For example, you to Chili skin for Shelly? Yeah, we're Shelly skin, we all know that. But is which Shelly or Princess Shelly the better skin? Well, I've got a special package and I have a feeling that what's inside is gonna help us find the answer. First up, the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. This right here is the previous version, the 4, and this is what I've been using daily for the past year. So getting this upgrade right here, oh, I'm so excited. I am seriously so glad they sent me the white. I didn't know which color they were sending, so I was so excited. Huge thank you to Samsung for sponsoring not only this video, but also for being a long-term partner on the channel. Oh, click that link below to check out Samsung's newest devices, which are top tier for gamers, especially the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. Seriously, more screen is just better for gaming. I've played Brawl Stars on a lot of devices, okay? Now, I just got the Galaxy Z Fold 5, but the Galaxy Z Fold 4 was by far my favorite phone to play Brawl Stars on. So I'm so excited to get this upgraded version because guys, the game on this is just insane. 7.6 inches of screen on your phone? What's this? Princess Shelly has sparkles, which I can tell from this amazingly large phone screen. Also, she drops shoes while she moves, which is like, what? I'm pretty sure no other skin does that. I know Princess Shelly is a super rare and Witch Shelly is an epic, but yeah, I'm gonna go with Princess Shelly as my favorite Shelly skin. And the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 is my new favorite device. Click the first link below to find out more. And click the second link for a chance to get your very own for free. Introducing the Galaxy Battles Superverse event. The entire Supercell community is coming together to compete in Brawl Stars, Clash clans and Clash Royale to find out who is the best in the Superverse. The finals are going to be streamed on September 30th and I will be there and you won't want to miss it. So register now. Powered by Samsung Galaxy and Supercell. <sighs> okay, up next we got Colt. Honestly, I don't even need to open up the device to tell you that Outlaw Colt is the worst skin. Personally, I think its colors are even worse than the regular Colt skin, which, oh, what are you saying? That's too small. Don't worry. I'll just open it up and boom. Oh no, it's Handsome Colt. Yeah, okay. Handsome Colt, it's hilarious, but we've got Bananas Colt, we also have Sharktooth Colt, and more importantly, Challenger Colt. And I do think I'm gonna go with Challenger Colt because he is a mobile gamer. And as a mobile gamer, Colt 100% deserves the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. Not just because it's a great gaming device, but because it is a great everything device. This is coming from me, who's used the Galaxy Z Fold 4 for like an entire year here. When it's folded up like this, it's amazing for taking pictures, browsing social media, texting my friends. And by friends, I mean my wife, she's my only friend. <laughs> but when you wanna get serious about something, you just unfold it. Not just for gaming either, okay? This is great for like watching YouTube videos <laughs> like mine. And you can even multitask with up to three apps on the screen all at once, which actually has been way more useful than I thought it would be. Oh, look at that. My wife just texted me and told me the Touchdown Bull is the worst skin for him. <laughs> what, you guys don't think she could have just randomly texted me about that right now? What? The point is, Touchdown Bull sucks. By the way, I'm not including any true gold or true silver skins in this video. And by the way, Bull Meg is definitely my favorite skin for Bull. He's so short and he's got all of Bull's personality it makes no sense. It's hilarious. But that's not all Samsung sent me. They also sent the Samsung Galaxy Tab S9 Plus. Oh my gosh. This tablet seriously is so thin. Take a look at that. It's insane. That is a beautiful looking tablet. So good. It even makes Boom Beach Brock look good. Seriously, you guys cannot tell on my cameras. It's so good. I honestly hate to say that Boombox Brock is like my least favorite skin on him, but he's got some amazing skins and all this one really offers is this dance. I'm not a very impressive dancer. <laughs> now I wanted to pick Postal Brock as my favorite, but it just does not beat Zeus Brock. Okay, Zeus Brock. Oh my gosh, this skin. He fires lightning bolts at people. Like, what is this? Okay. All of which you can see in glorious detail on the Galaxy Tab S9 Plus because the dynamic AMOLED screens are the best I've ever seen on a tablet. Like, it's so good. My cameras can't even justify it. It's amazing. Plus, it comes with an S Pen, which seriously would have just been amazing for when I was back in school for all of my, uh, studying. <laughs> okay, I would have been gaming on it, let's be honest here. <laughs> Seriously, a massive thank you to Samsung for sponsoring this video. Okay, up next we got Rico, and the thing with Rico is, look at it, he's got some really awesome skins. Chicken Rico, Firefly Rico, Guard Rico, Loaded Rico, Popcorn Rico, Ricochet, are you kidding me? I have no idea how I'm supposed to pick. Out of principle, my editor will not allow me to say that Chicken Rico is the worst. So I've gotta go with Firefly or Guard Rico, but they're both really cool. I mean, I can't pick Popcorn Rico. And people are just gonna be upset if I pick Ricochet. <laughs> okay, worst skin, I'm going with with Firefly Rico. Man, you can call me crazy if you want to, but I think that I'm sticking with Loaded Rico as my favorite skin for him. He's, it's just like, it's just such a flex. Up next, we got Spike. Lots of really pretty cool skins, honestly. Spike's kind of a popular one. I'm gonna go with Logmas for my least favorite. Man, this is ridiculous. I think I'm going with Mask Spike here. Like, it's only a rare skin and it's like a bunch of skins in one. Dude, Terra. 
Tick. You got Colt. You got Ape It. You got El Primo. You got, look at this, you got Bruce. I feel like I should go with Dark Lord Spike, but I'm going with Mask Spike, call me crazy. Next we got Barley and least favorite, I've got to go with Red Wizard Barley. I feel like it's easy because it's just kind of a, it's kind of a cop out. You get this one for free. Why would you want Red Wizard Barley, right? Gosh, and this year, I think I'm going to go with Unicorn Knight Barley is my favorite Barley skin. It's so colorful and it looks so nice on my new device. Okay, next we got Jesse. This is a hard one. They all recently got remodeled, so they, they all look really fantastic. I'm going to go with Red Dragon Jesse. You know, you really can't go wrong with Summer Jesse. Really great value skin. But I think I'm going to go with Tanuki Jesse as my favorite Jesse skin. Okay. Nita skins. I'm going with Koala Be Nita for my least favorite. Oh, there's some really good ones here. Well, she's got so many awesome skins. I don't know if it's the fact that this one's new or not. Like, you can see through it. Like, what is up with that? You see through her head? I'm going with Gummy Bear Nita this year. Next, we got Dynamite. He's got a lot of not great skins, mostly because of all of these random ones. I think Flamango Mike is my least favorite. And you know what? Dynamite's newest skin, Tangu Mike, is going to be my favorite for him. El Primo's also got some really just like not great skins. I, I'm just, I don't follow the sports for soccer, football, whatever you call it. I don't follow the sports, okay? <laughs> least favorite's kind of a tough call between these two. I actually like the colors on this one. Um, El Primo Club uh, Nacional. That's what we're going for, for least favorite. Oh, best skin. El Tigro. This one's awesome. Okay, next we got Mortis, and it's kind of funny because in the past, I've said that Rockabilly Mortis was one of my favorite, but I think it might not be anymore. I think it's worn off. So I'm going to go with this as my least favorite Mortis skin. As for my favorite, it's one of the Mecha Mortis skins. I just can't decide on my color, but I'm, I'm going to go with Light Mecha Mortis for right now. I mean, look at that. Oh, it's so cool. Look how big his sword is. Okay, least favorite Crow skin is going to be Captain Crow. Oh, and the best one, Phoenix Crow. It just recently got reamed done, and just looks so clean. Oh, you know what? Crow Bone's also really good. Oh, and it's less expensive. Oh, no, I gotta go with it. Phoenix Crow is too cool. Okay, Poco has a lot of skins that are just not my favorite. Pirate Poco, staying my least favorite this year. But finally, Poco has a cool skin, in my opinion. Desperado Poco is my favorite. Least favorite bow skin? Gotta be Warrior Bow. It's just, I don't know, I like it. And it's funny because we got all the mecha skins, which are legendary and cost more, but I actually like Horus Bow and Underworld Bow a little bit more. Either one could be it. I'm going to go with Horus Bow as my favorite for now. Okay, Piper. Least favorite is Calavera. That's not hard. Surprisingly, even <laughs> more least favorite than Pink Piper. I like Pink Piper. But Mariposa Piper. <laughs> this skin is super dope. Best skin for Piper right now. Next, we got Pam. Least favorite is Holiday Pam. Oh, Evil Queen Pam is so cool. But Stonks Pam, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going with Stonks Pam. This skin's too cool. We're doing it. That's my favorite Pam skin for right now. Next is Terra. And Stara, or Iris Terra, recently got redone done and actually looks pretty good, but it's probably... Yeah, it's still my least favorite Terra skin. You know what? And Rage Quit Terra is my favorite now. This one's a really cool one, and it's, I mean, the newest Terra skin. Least favorite Daryl skin is Mascot Daryl. I don't watch the sports. <laughs> I think Cupcake Daryl's my favorite. <laughs> the skin is great. I almost forgot about it. Oh, this is easy. Least favorite skin for Penny is Little Helper Penny. You know, and I don't know what it is about people not liking Smuggler Penny, but this is my favorite Penny skin. This one's pretty cool in my opinion, but Trash Panda Penny's a close second. Wow, Frank doesn't have a whole lot of skins. I'm going to go with Caveman Frank is my least favorite. Dude, and Spirit Knight Frank, this skin is so epic. I've got to go with this as my favorite for sure. Least favorite's Gene skin. I probably will always be Pirate Gene. This one's awful in my opinion. You know what? And no matter how much I like Swamp Gene, I'm going to go with Evil Gene for my favorite. This one's so cool. Least favorite skin for Tick is probably Tick Shooky. I even like Snowbang Tick more. And Cerberus Tick, like, is this even a question? This is definitely the best Tick skin right now. Okay, I'm about to upset a lot of people, but right now I think my least favorite Leon skin is Shark Leon. I even like Leon the Stray more. This skin is it only costs 29 gems. Are you kidding me? Favorite Leon skin, though. Still Werewolf Leon. This one's so cool. Uh, least favorite Rosa skin's got to be Brawloween Rosa. <laughs> and Mantis Rosa's cool. But I think that Coco Rosa's going to be my favorite. This is a pretty cool one. She's got a sweet moves, dances around. She's a much better dancer than Brock. Next we got Carl. Least favorite is Goblin Carl. I kind of forgot about this skin. And for my favorite, Sultan Carl actually uh, takes the victory right now. Least favorite BB skin. Oh, the hair things! Actually... 
I think Vicious BB actually beats it this year. <laughs> Maybe even BB Lante. I don't know. There's a fine. Zombie BB is my favorite BB skin. This one's so cool. Okay, this is going to upset some people, but 8-bit classic. Least favorite 8-bit skin. <sighs> Man, and Virus 8-bit. I didn't even realize this was a legendary skin. That's an expensive skin, but it's it's really cool. I do really like Saloon 8-bit, though. He's really fun, but Virus 8-bit's my favorite. Feels kind of cheap for me to pick Sleepy Sandy as my least favorite because it's only 29 gems, but it's my least favorite. And my favorite Sandy skin is Lantern Sandy. This is cool. Okay, least favorite B skin. It's funny, but I'm going to go with Gold Neko B. I actually like Neko B more than Gold Neko B, which this one's more expensive. And for my favorite B skin, I'm going with Arch Villain B. Least favorite M skin, Call of Gems. Easy. Favorite M skin, Harajuku M. This one's actually really cool. <laughs> Agent P is my least favorite Mr. P skin. And Mr. Fly, this is my favorite 8-bit skin. It's a new favorite. That's cool. It's so weird. Least favorite Max skin, GT Max. I dislike these colors even more than regular Max. Favorite Max skin, Hermes Max. You know, I even like it more than like the Leopard Max and Panther Max and Streetwear Max. Does she not have any mythic ones? She, oh, she has Coney Max. What? Hermes Max is way better. Um, least favorite Jackie skin, Constructor Jackie, even though I don't really like Gift Express Jackie either. And I know there's Ultra Driller Jackie, which looks cool, but I actually like Jet Ski Jackie more. The water effects are really awesome. It's like, Doug. Oh, Gale doesn't have a whole lot of skins to choose from, so it's really tough to say that, like, Merchant Gale's my least favorite Gale skin, but it's actually really cool. Nutcracker Gale, though. That's my favorite Gale skin. Least favorite Nani skin is probably Sally Nani. I know it's, I mean, it's cool if you're a line friends friend, fan, but I actually like the colors of Retro Nani like a fairly a bit. I don't know. It's weird, but Aries Nani, this skin, guys, it's so cool. Okay, next we got Sprout. This is a tough one because the Sprout's got some good skins. Like, can you say Tropical Sprout is like your least favorite? Yeah, okay. Least favorite skin, Tropical Sprout. Favorite skin though, Corrupted Sprout is so weird and creepy and fun, but it doesn't have any particle effects or anything like that, so Lunar Sprout's kind of really cool. Honestly, they're all really sweet, but Corrupted Sprout's my favorite. I'm convinced the Surge has no bad skins. If I have to absolutely pick a least favorite, I gotta go with do it yourself. And you know what? Maybe it's recency bias, but the newest Kraken Surge skin is really cool. I think this is my favorite. Uh, least favorite skin for Colette is Navigator Colette. And I like Colette's other skins, but Trixie Colette I think is still my favorite Colette skin. Amber only has two skins, so Amber De La Vega is my least favorite. And Frost Queen Amber is definitely my favorite. This one could have been a mythic rarity, in my opinion. Oh, Lou! Lou has good skins! Okay. Uh, Smooth Lou is my least favorite. And can I pick Burger Lou over King Lou? I don't know. This one doesn't have the same appeal as like Loaded Rico does. I'm going to go with Burger Lou. I don't know if it's because I'm in a weird mood or not, but like Burger Lou, he shoots burgers at people. Oh, this is tough. We have two skins to choose from, Overlord or Wizard. Oh, this is unfair. They're both awesome, okay? But I, I guess I'm, I'm going to go with... I'm going to pick Wizard Byron as my least favorite and Overlord Byron as my favorite. The colors are just so cool. Okay, Edgar. Um... <laughs> this one's so funny. I'm going to go with Blackbird as my least favorite, but that's not because I dislike this skin. It's a really cool skin, but Orochi Edgar has got to be my favorite. This skin is so cool. Least favorite rough skin. I'm going to go with Marshall Ruffs and Ronan Ruffs as my favorite. Okay, Stu Superstar is going to be my least favorite skin and Headless Rider Stu. Are you kidding me? This skin's so cool. Oh, Bell's got some good skins too, okay? I, I'm going to go with Ivy Bell as my least favorite, but I do like it. You know what? I'm going to go with Bell Goldhand as my favorite Bell skin, which is like, I didn't expect that. Okay, least favorite Squeak skin is Potato Squeak. I know this. Some people love it. It's just too weird for me. But my favorite is First Blob Squeak. I don't know what it is about the skin. The colors, I, I like this green. I don't know if I like greens, but this one's just sweet. We don't have a lot of choices for Grom. Bunny Grom is my least favorite, and Franken Grom's my favorite. Yeah, it is. Surprisingly, Buzz actually has a lot of skins. I'm going to go with Kaiju. Buzz is my least favorite. I do like the colors, but you know, it's just a recolor. And you know what? I think that I actually like Buzzette as my favorite Buzz skin. It's a really cool skin. All the colors are fun. Okay, Griff, Slayer Griff is my least favorite. I still don't have great skins. And then I guess High Score Griff is my favorite. The thing is, is like, uh, Griff's like one of my favorite brawlers. Like, why doesn't he have better skins? Least favorite Ash skin is gonna be Krampus Ash. I mean, it's fine. It's just not my favorite. And 
pizza oven ash is my favorite. Ash should have cooler skins, I think. I mean, ninja ash is okay, but I'd rather have pizza oven ash. Ooh, Meg does not have a single bad skin. They are all really awesome. I'm gonna have to pick Beetle Meg as my least favorite, and it is a tough call between Monster Truck and Megalodon, but I'm gonna go with Megalodon as my favorite. Next, we got Lola. Lawless Lola is definitely my least favorite. In fact, I didn't even grind out the Power League to, like, get it, so I just bought it a year later. And I think Keaton and Lula is my favorite. It's really cool. Next, we got Fang, and... <sighs> They're just fine. Octo Fang's my least favorite, and Furious Fang's my favorite. Next, we got Eve. Spiky Eve's my least favorite. And Baiku Eve. This one's actually pretty dope. Next, we got Janet, and G-Force Janet's my least favorite, which, I mean, it's it's okay. But Valkyrie Janet's awesome. Popstar Janet's awesome. Dark Fairy Janet's awesome. I think I'm going to go with Valkyrie Janet is my favorite, although Dark Fairy Janet might actually win it out eventually. I don't know. We'll see over time. Next, we got Bonnie. Foot Bonnie, my least favorite. I don't watch the sports. <laughs> and Empress Brawny is my favorite by default, kind of, but it's pretty cool. Ooh. Otis has a couple of really cool skins, but the thing is Oni Otis is so awesome. I can't pick Fair Otis. So Fair Otis is my least favorite, I guess, even though it's so cool. But Oni Otis, oh, this skin, this is a really cool skin. Definitely my favorite. Next, we got Sam and yeah, this one's actually fine. Sam the Teddy is my least favorite and Caesar Sam's my favorite. It actually fits his personality really well. Next is Gus. And we only have world champion Gus, so he's my favorite and least favorite. Okay, next we got Buster. It's between these two. I'm gonna go with Chainsaw Buster as my least favorite, and Crocodile Buster is my favorite out of the two. Okay, Chester. Um, you know, Dark Chester's my least favorite, and Wood Spirit Chester's my favorite. This one's actually pretty cool for only super rare. Okay, next we got Gray, and I actually kind of dislike the colors on Runaway Gray, so that's my least favorite, and Detective Gray is my favorite. Next we got Mandy. This is easy. MC Mandy, least favorite, and Magma Mandy is like, it's a really cool skin. RC is easy. RT Patrol is my least favorite. You know what? This one's actually not my favorite. If they came out with a cooler RT skin, it would probably get replaced. But for now, this is my favorite. Willow has Axel Willow. This is my least favorite skin. I think I'd rather go with regular Willow. <laughs> for Maisie, we've got Tech Maisie's my least favorite. Jungle Queen Maisie's my favorite. Shark Tank Hank is just fine. For Cordelia, Spore Mind Cordelia, I guess it's my favorite. It's not like the best, but it does win over Poison Cap Cordelia. And finishing us off, we got Draco Doug. Which is actually a pretty cool skin for only 29 gems. I have a feeling some of you guys are going to disagree with me in the comment section below. That's totally fine, as long as you're nice. But let me know. I'd love to know. And also a huge thank you once again to Samsung for sponsoring this video. Click the link in the description below to get your very own Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 or Galaxy Tab S9 Plus. For now, we'll see you guys in the next episode.